At this point, we've done some pretty questionable things on this channel, like looked up things that we shouldn't Google, visited the dark side of YouTube, played some of the scariest games, but today is a little bit different. It's, it's gonna, gonna get, get a bit, bit creepy. creepy. Why, you may ask? Well, because today we will be looking at the weirdest videos to ever exist on YouTube. And I must warn you before we start that some of these things are definitely nightmare inducing, so be careful. Anyways, let's do this. All right, so first up is a video called Let Me Hear Your War Cry. I'm not feeling good about this one. I feel like there's gonna be some... Is it just this the entire time? So I don't know what's happening here, but definitely a weird one. All right, we're gonna soften things up with my PP. Pee -pee. Guy looks like me. Okay, at least he's not showing it. This guy looks like he's definitely a registered offender. If you ever see a guy with a mustache and then a plaid short sleeve shirt like that, there's like a 75% chance that he's a registered offender. And you know what I'm talking about. Okay, so we have a Harlem Shake makes the crops grow. All right, let's definitely blur that. I don't want this video to be age restricted. What am I even watching? What am I doing with my life? Oh my God. Gosh, these people get together and they do they what do they say like oh I have an idea bro like come over at 1 p.m. on a Saturday like I have this really cool video idea and is this what they do like and why are people watching it why am I watching this all right so here we have a Hellman's mayo commercial this is probably the worst quality thing I've ever watched in my entire life this is potato quality I mean this doesn't make me crave mayo okay this is extremely uncanny I feel like I have to look behind me when I'm watching videos like this what am, what is this. How is this allowed on YouTube? I'm definitely sinning right now. I can't watch this any longer. All right, on to Monday night, and this is from the same guy, Super Ed. So I think he just makes really weird videos. He just has like a red mask on. It looks like he de-skinned somebody and then put it on his face, but he's just like flexing. I don't I don't get it. Also, why is it such low quality? Why The common theme amongst these weird videos is that they're all shot in literally 144p. Okay, this is Octagon Road. I, don't, I have no context to this video. All I know, this is Jack Black. <laughs> Mario Kart Double Dash in the background, best Mario Kart. I think that's a playlist song. I think I gotta add that to my uh, my shorts playlist. I'm loving that. All right, this one is called Rock Hard, you know, the other name for a rooster. And it's, I mean, I'm sure this is blurred for you guys right now, but just know it's a Sonic skin and the skin has nothing to do with Sonic and everything to do with a male reproductive organ. <laughs> I mean... This might be the greatest video I've ever watched. Sonic, or shall I say son dick? Okay, nice. You got an A, perfect score. All right, so this is a Viagra commercial. If you don't know what Viagra is, don't look it up. You're too young for it. Okay, guy's clearly wearing like a fake face. All right, he's, he's peacocking a bit, showing his feathers. Oh, okay, you see what he's spinning on? Yeah. Yeah, if you don't know what it is, it's just like, a, it's a miracle drug for people who have um, ED. And don't look that up either. All right, so there's a Markiplier video called Mr. Kitty Saves the World. Why is this considered weird? Okay, so obviously, I was- Thank you. What, just, how did we escalate from- Hello, everybody, my name is Markiplier. I think he needs our help. Okay, he uploaded yesterday, so I think he's alive and well. I think he's thriving. Okay, scare me for a second. Whew. Down to clown murder hatchets girls. This is- this is so haram. What a degenerate video. Oh my gosh, this whole thing. What a degenerate. It looks like they just put every bad thing on screen to pollute the minds of people. I can't watch this in good faith. That's terrible. All right, this one's called El Estío de Peter La Inguia Oficial because I am Spanish. I don't like how this started off. Why is he so lanky? He looks like Slender Man. This guy has to be like Photoshopping himself. I can't tell if he's like seven feet, 120 pounds or what. That's crazy. That, that weirded me out the most, I'd say. All right, here we have the spirit of Christmas. All right, that is a baby. I don't think babies sleep in beds like that. I feel like he should be in some sort of cradle. He's being woken up by a pretty rabid reindeer. I think that's Rudolph, actually. Ooh! Ugh. Okay. He's like the anti-Grinch. Oh no. All right, this is Dolphin Muzzle, which I mean already sounds like a bit of a weird video. Yeah, looks like Squidward. I don't know if this is, cause this is way before AI and CGI. This was probably filmed in the 90s, uploaded in the early 2000s. It must be a costume, but that's a great costume. Okay, stop getting so close to me. Oh my gosh. It's been a while. Okay. I've don't, missed you. No, don't, don't talk to me, please. It's okay. No. You can look at my butt. No, <laughs> how do you know I'm looking too? Ugh. I don't like this guy. He's, don't draw me. This isn't Titanic. Stop. Don't draw me. Don't look down at your sheath and back up at me. Don't do all that. Don't do that, please. I love you. Okay, I love you too. All right, fine. I fell in love with you right there. What do you want me to say? All right, so this is... <laughs> I, can't, 
couldn't even intro the video, like right off the bat. Oh my gosh, what a weird thing. It's like a stalk of celery slash Squidward. Why does every weird thing look like Squidward? It's like Squidward was invented to be this like really creepy figure. The, my, the human mind is spectacular, how you could just come up with stuff like this. What? Literally what? This is weird. You're right. This is definitely the weird side of YouTube. There's no lies here. All right, so this is Mickey Mouse Fan Club. So this should be something fun. We got a little dancing from Mickey Mouse, I believe. I was not expecting to see that. Who's the creepiest here? It might actually be Goofy. Let's take a look at Goofy. Let's get a close up of him. He looks very, very creepy. There he is. Eee! And there's eyes in his mouth. What is going on with Goofy? And why is his hat able to just bounce back and forth? That's that cartoon logic. Or this video is called Going to the Store. 33 million views. Why do I not know this? Oh, I know this. This is very weird. This is a very weird video, so beware. Might be the weirdest video thus far. It's just like a mannequin. Just going to the store. Let's see what store he's going to. I bet she's going to the supermarket because guess what? He needs to eat. All right, going to a parking garage. Yep. So he was going to the store and he got stuck. Poor guy. All right, this video is called Bananas Exploding on the Face. So I think we know what we're in for here. Very scary mask. Looks like Michael Myers with bananas. Michael Myers if he was in Brazil. Ooh, definitely would not try this at home. It's a Brooklyn-based artist. What is art about this? This is not art. If anything, I mean, this is, this is torture to yourself. How, how do bananas explode just from a little bit of light? Oh yeah, and we're just grooving out in space. This is what I imagine the fifth dimension looks like. Just a bunch of different animals across all these different planes, just dancing, having a good time out there in the universe. What a comforting video. All right, here's a Minecraft intro. Not sure why this is weird. I think every Minecraft intro is a little weird. I think the game's a little weird. That, you know what? I might get into Minecraft because of that video. That is not weird. That is awesome. SpongeBob Cave Eden Alive Creator Upload. This is... Ooh! Why do I get chills from that? It's a screen, but that was weird. All right, we have a Pringle advert. So there's Mr. Pringle, badly drawn. I don't like how his hair flares up. Okay, cool. Just fade into obscurity. Thank you. All right, Menio, Birth of the Santa Nalga. I don't know what these words mean on my screen. What was Ricky doing? Oh, let's definitely uh, blur this. Oh no, let's blur the entirety of this video, that whole area. Oh, I don't like where this is heading. I don't like where this is started. I just don't like this. Okay, okay. Quality meats is what this video is called. And it's just all the good meats. Jeez, imagine they packaged up humans just like they did with the chickens and stuff. It's like PETA propaganda. Okay, quality meats. That's definitely quality meat. I mean, I wouldn't suggest eating it. All right, so this one confuses me because the title is Upside Down. You Did Well is the name of this. How do you do that? How does YouTube allow you to put titles like that? This feel welcome back. Did I just come back to the same channel? What am I looking at? Why is there a deer on my screen? Oh, this is the A Lamau. This is classic. This isn't weird. This is like ingrained in meme culture. It's classic A Lamau. They're just vibing out. Are they beyond a volcano? I've never realized that. All right, Henry Eats. My first short animation for this guy, Ben Wheel. So let's see what Henry's up to. So this is Henry. What does he eat? Does Henry eat this guy? Coming down, coming down. Henry does eat. So what doesn't Henry eat? I'm curious. There's Henry, he's a good lad, takes care of his family. Oh no, we have something coming from the cupboard. It's like his dog maybe. Let's see if cigarettes for teeth. And here he goes drinking his water. Okay, this has become very random. Now all of a sudden we're out in the forest. There's an old show called Xavier Renegade Angel. It was on Cartoon Network. It's one of my favorite shows ever. It's very weird and it reminds me of this. It's like the same sort of animation, just like, except it's actually really clever. This is on YouTube Kids, so I automatically know it's gonna be weird. Everything on YouTube Kids is weird. So this is Young Anna is Crazy and she's dancing and it's unlisted. So this video was taken down for whatever reason. I'm sure Disney reached out for that cease and desist, that takedown notice. Why is this on YouTube Kids? If I watch my three-year-old watching this, I would think that they're scarred for life. I'd have to bring them to some sort of therapy. It's just her dancing the whole time. Elsa doesn't even come in. It's just Anna. All right, we have a minion and is that Daniel Radcliffe? Is that Harry Potter? Yep, it is. They're both T-posing. Okay, so I guess Harry Potter always wins. Oh, but it's Snape or Voldemort or a goat Snape priest nun thing. All right, this is Twinkle Twinkle Little Star Creepy Nursery Rhymes. Not sure how people even find this video. It has less than 10K views. All right, hey kids, AI for adults. Let's see how cursed this is. Oh, okay. Kind of looks like Biggest me. Twinkle, twinkle, twinkle little, little star. 
How I wonder what you are. What is all this SpongeBob poop? There used to be a website, or it's, I'm sure it still exists, called Creepy Pasta, and all the SpongeBob dark episodes are always like the weirdest things to observe. And I feel like this is something like a lost media piece. All right, we're not gonna watch this. We don't want to see that violence occur. I don't want to poison your minds. All right, the, this video is called Question Mark, so I don't know what's gonna happen here. It looks like Markiplier. Now it looks like Santa Claus. All right, I don't know. It's just somebody being edgy and creating art. That, that's art. Like when I see videos like that and they have no meaning to them, but they're weird, that's just somebody being weird for the sake of being weird. I went to NYU, so that's like 90% of the kids. I'm sure this guy went to NYU. All right, galaxy star hip hop. Playing with a fidget spinner. That has to be fake. What is it? Why am I watching aliens brawl? And I like, do aliens even have nuts? Like, how does that work? Doesn't feel like anatomically correct. All right, this is cows and cows and cows. 70 million views. So these bovine, it's just cows. It's just cows and cows and cows. Nodding their heads, having some fun. Oh no, what happens to the cows here? The cows become spiders, of course. That's like the logical next step in a cow's evolution. They're like Pokemon. You give them like a sunstone, they turn into these giant tarantulas. Does anything else happen to them? Oh yeah, they elongate. Gate. They're like slinkies. Yeah, if you didn't realize, cows are very malleable. It's what happens like when cows surpass the age of four. All right, here we go. Nosy boink. Nosy bonk. So this was an old kids program. Of course, it's British. It was on uh, the BBC, I believe. If you're a Brit, let me know if you remember this. This is probably like your SpongeBob. Oh, more noses grow and he can just replace his nose now. Wait, he has a face beneath his nose or is that his nostrils? All right, here we go. We got a buck. I believe it's a buck. It's not a doe because he's got the antlers. So he's definitely a male deer. It's that really weird blender animation. He seems to be moving but not going anywhere. Oh, he's he's uh, Gangnam styling. Oh, look at him. Oh, I'm Gangnam style. Hey. All right, this is called Obey the Walrus. I don't obey anything other than God. I feel like I've watched this video before, which I don't love. Like, why do I have memories of this video? All right, this guy's got a Halloween costume. Let's see it. I'm excited. I'm always rooting for people. Can you stop staring at me? I must say, when was this made? 10 years ago. Okay, so if I was in 2013 and I saw this video and I didn't know any better about CGI AI, I'd be like, whoa. I've seen Avatar. I've seen Avatar 2, okay? I've watched Avengers Endgame. I've watched peak CGI. This is garbage. All right, here we go. This is called Because, made by the same channel, Syriac. So this guy is just like, he likes playing around with his face. All right, that's your face. You know what I always think? People who make these kinds of videos and then they go to their nine to fives and then like somebody found their video. And then like, what do you, like, how do you approach this? Do you go up to him and be like, oh dude, like I saw your channel, like sick. Cause I'd be like, Ooh, so you saw me do this? I'd be a little creeped out. All right, here we have the Chuckle Hut. And we have Emma Watson with a bald cap. You don't scare me anymore. You know how many videos I've watched? This is not weird. This is this is enchanting. This is charming. I love this. I think I'm truly desensitized to weirdness, to creepiness, to darkness. This is called Ball Face. It looks like that moon from Super Smash Brothers. You know what I'm talking about? Or it's from Legend of Zelda. It's like that creepy moon. It looks like we're in the back rooms and there's just, I guess it's a, it's a ball face. That's what it is. It's a ball with a face on it. It's not lying to us. Ooh, I thought that was uh, something different at first, but it looks to be uh, not as egregious. I think people knew what I thought that was. All right, so what is this? Like the Michelin Man before he was famous? Looks like Patrick Star bodysuit. Oh, it's a Pokemon. Who's that Pokemon? It's di- Oh, so this is Ditto. All right, now we have how to improve your bread. Let's see if he teaches us any tricks here. More yeast. Yeah, imagine someone taking a 3D modeling class just to create this. That's what I think of whenever I see these, these weirdos. All right, pumpkin visits good burger. Here we go. That's a good burger out in the middle of nowhere. What is this, Roblox? Minecraft, one of those sandbox games. All right, so it's literally a pumpkin visiting a good burger. Is it because I'm black? Uh, I don't even know at this point. All right, this is more just weird characters interacting, this time at a bar. An alien with hair. Do aliens have hair? I guess that's only mammals and humans. This is nonsense. This is nonsense. It is weird, but it's also nonsense. All right. Let's go on and The adventure. snack that smiles back, goldfish. Probably the best snack out there. I think it's the best cracker. I don't like that. Patrick Starr! Wait, what is this cameo? Oh. I am going to buy some goldfish crackers. Oh, wait, I don't have any money. Uh, maybe you should get a job. Did Patrick never have a job? I feel like there was an episode where he worked at the Krabby Patty. Worked at the Krusty Krab, not the Krabby Patty. My gosh. All right, this is Sandy Needs More Nuts. She's getting lonely. Don't go for it. 
Okay, I think that was the right move in that situation because she was vying for your nuts, SpongeBob. Okay, this video is probably the greatest video I've ever watched. It's Super Smash Brothers Ultimate characters and their blank size. Okay, no context, just gets right into it. Five inches, Mario. I would argue that it's probably a bit more. 10.5 inches, Donkey Kong. Why am I so intrigued at this? All right, five and a half for Link. Yep, zero inches here. 3.2 inches, 3.9. Yeah. See, why is Luigi? I guess because he's taller and like slender. Makes sense. 3.1 inches. Okay. This guy's just ahead of his time. What a great video. 1.4 inches. Yeah, I guess he's like a little boy, right? 1.5. Jigglypuff's a girl. Well, I know there's male and female Jigglypuffs, but yep. Zero for Peach. 8.7 inches and spiky. <laughs> Uh, okay. Six inches, but zero girth for Game & Watch? How does that work? Oh, because he's he's 2D. Oh my gosh. The Mastodon himself, the Italian Stallion with 11 inches for Wario. Rob with 10. Can we see it? How is It's a robot. Little Mac. There's a reason they call him Little Mac. 0. 0.5. Wow. Oh my gosh. The Red Rocket, 5.6 you're putting him at? Why does the duck have nothing? Oh my gosh. I guess that's it. Are they counting his tail? By far the greatest video I've ever watched on YouTube. Okay. Hand fingers, what's happening here? Oh my gosh, it's like you don't know at which point it's starting. This is like pure hallucination here. Okay, that is weird. It's weird because I, I don't know where it's starting. Like you see how it's starting to form, but like, how did he do that? All right, we have Pikachu on acid, which I mean, this is definitely gonna be a little weird, I'm sure. Anything involving acid. Let's get to the good part here. Oh, so as if Muck's acid was actually LSD and not the acid waste that we were to believe. Yeah, in a way, it's more harmful to give somebody like this psychological torture than just a little bit of acid. I mean, Pikachu's radioactive, so I don't think Pikachu actually cares about the waste. Like Ash said, it's ineffective, but this is very effective. Anything with a mind, I mean, you gotta be careful. All right, so this is called Potato Salad by a pretty massive channel, 1ENG. Oh, yeah, this is the quality I'm looking for. The guy looks like Seth Everman. Let me guess. There's going to be a guy with potato salad. Yeah, he's got the Tanjiro umbrella. Hopefully he's not storing it in his butt. All right, things have escalated pretty quickly. What's that in your hand? All right, is this the potato salad recipe? Stamper, I really was your brother. I was just testing you to see if you'd still love me if I was a burglar. Love, Mick. Oh, no. And then he turns his brother into potato salad. Oh, no. Are you supposed to put ketchup in potato salad? All right, follow the ball, real illusion. Okay, I'm not sure how this is weird, but let's go ahead and do this. It feels like I'm at a baseball game, so it's in the middle, left, right, center, left... Right, okay, I'm usually really good at this. So it's in the middle, guaranteed 100% in the middle. Where's the ball, middle, bet my life on it, number two. No, no, uh-huh, here we go. What? That's cheating, you can't just Zack King me like that. What is going on? Are you telling me reality is fake? What am I looking at? Oh my gosh, it was all a setup. All right, so this video is apparently a weird one from The Sims, a game that I've played once or twice. I like The Sims. I think it's a fun little game that you can just kind of relax and live your life through a simulation, i.e. Sims. I don't want my pizza burning, so I agree. I don't want my pizza burning either. Looks like it's not gonna burn. You took it out. It's a very flexible rack to be taken out that much. Why is that pizza so big? Can we just run that back? That pizza is about the size of like three of her heads. What a massive slice. Looks like she went to Yonkers to get that slice. All right, so now we have Final Taco, which is YouTube poop. If you know what that is, it's just like YouTube poop of Rocco's modern day life. Rocky! This was an old show on Nickelodeon. Uh, it's, 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 very, very weird indeed. Very weird indeed. This video is called Yeah, Knob That Boglin, and it's a guy with a green stick just like poking at this face mask. I guess he's knobbing that boglin. Yeah, you go ahead and knob that boglin. Get it nice, nice and in there. Mix it like meatloaf. Oh yeah, there we go. That boglin's you can't take it. Okay. I mean, you're definitely knobbing that boglin. All right, enough of knobbing that boglin. How about we leave the boglin alone? All right, so this video is unlisted, so it's kind of hard to find if you don't have the link. Luckily, I have the link, but this is Playtime for PlayStation, a stop motion love story. So I believe it was maybe like age restricted or something, which is why this was unlisted. All right, so... PlayStation's trying to flirt with Sega. Can't go anywhere. And now he's looking around. Who else can I mate with? Where's my mate? And very clean rug. Oh no, N64. Oh, yeah, get him out of there. You need to breed with something good. Find yourself a GameCube. Who do you find? Ooh, an SNES. Eee, what do they give birth to? I'm guessing it's gonna be like a Game Boy Color or something. Absolutely nasty. You know what, no climax to the video, a little disappointed in that. I thought there was gonna be like a baby that pops out immediately. I guess there's a gestation period for these consoles. Maybe that's why. All right, this video is called G. 
All right, that was G from the channel G. G, G, you got it. Fur displacement test. So if you could basically spot the fur and then you're able to hunt these animals. So here we go. So I could see the cat loud and clear. All right, this is definitely weird. A little too weird for me. All right, so this is the same creator for the cat, but now this is dogs. This is a cute one. This kind of looks like my Bruno. All right, now they're fluffing out uncontrollably. Ah, and look at the irony here. Look who created this video, Mad Cat Lady. So this is, I think, propaganda against dogs. All right, now we have uh, Bob Ross beat the devil out of it. Oh, so it's just, I'm guessing this is looped. It's just him beating the devil out of the brush. And just beat the devil out of him. Yeah, I don't know. What is his backstory? Why is he so beloved? I know he passed away. I know he's like a great artist, but I know there's like more lore. I feel like they need to make a movie on him so then I could like learn more about him. Cause like the name Bob Ross comes up. Everyone's like, oh my gosh. But I never like, maybe I should just Wikipedia it. I'm too lazy. Next video. All right, so this is Gimme Pizza Slow. So it's a Mary Kate and Ashley commercial about pizza and it's just slowed down. But if you slow down anything, it's weird. P-I-C-C-A. What is this supposed to sound like? I want pizza. Even when it's like normal speed, this is weird. I think because they de-pitched the voices. So they put a lot of bass into the voices and it just doesn't make a lot of sense coming from these like four-year-olds mouth. Ah, you see, are they four or are they six? I don't know. I think my worst judge of age is within like that three to like six range. I have no idea. If you're three, if you're six, you could be in kindergarten or you could be breastfeeding. I don't know. that The difference between three and six, four and six, I have no idea. So if you're six-year-old and watching this video, don't get offended if I go up to you. I'm like, oh, are you three? Because you might be. I don't know. You're the same thing. You're all like meshed together in my head. All right, so this is Lull, I Hate My Parents song goes wrong. He's cranking that soldier boy. This is definitely made 2008. Did you just flip me off? No. Did you just flip no, you? No. I just saw Mom, you. it's for a video. Get him. It's for a video. I saw you. It's for a video. I saw you. Mom, it's just... for What I feel like I'm watching some sort of like trauma being dumped right now by the mom. She like hates her kid. I feel like this is like a normal occurrence for them. I think it was staged. If I'm if I'm going to give you my expertise as a behind the scenes YouTuber on stuff that's staged versus stuff that's authentic, I would say that this is staged. And the reason I believe so is because he went ahead and uploaded it shamelessly, which means that there's probably an element of scripting to this. I think the mom, he might have softly said to her, hey, mom, I'm going to do something that annoys you. So he didn't say what he was going to do, but he did something still pretty bad. All right, so this is the Binding of Isaac Rebirth release trailer. I don't know why this is weird. What? It, let's definitely blur this. Why is this still up on the IGN channel? Wow, so this is like actually what they intended to put out. I've never played the game Binding of Isaac. I think I've heard of it before, but like, does the game include a lot of weird things like this? I am so confused. I That's... That's creepy. That's definitely weird. That one takes the cake. That's a weird one. All right, so this is just called Ball Buster by Free Mago. I don't know what's going to happen here. The name of the game is Ball Buster. Anything with that 1950s voice is scary. It's always a bit weird. You know that game's dangerous. That's probably a banned game now. They say that video games teach violence, but I would argue that the violence you learn in video games is half of what you would learn from a game like this. This game can ruin generations upon generations, if you know what I mean. Um, all right, this is age restricted, so I don't like where this is heading. Yeah. This was uploaded less than a month. Look how old this video is. This was uploaded, according to this person, not even a year, sorry, after YouTube began. This is like someone's like, I need to get this content out. I need a creative outlet. I, I gotta put out what this artistic Video. The following contains scenes that some viewers may find disturbing. Viewer discretion is advised. You never like when things start off like that. You know it's gonna actually be creepy. I could also can't tell if this is, okay, this is not actual people. Looks like some sort of animation created. No. Okay, goodbye. Okay, there's her little kids. Me and my little ones. M mommy. Okay, I don't think that's her son. Looks like the prince of... The UK. I mean, this is a little unsettling. It's just, I don't know what's happening. There's really not much going on here. Like, who are they decapitating? All right, the title of this video is the weirdest video you will ever see, guaranteed. So let's see if this is actually true. Okay, so she has like a fish attached to her armpit. I'll just peel it like this. All right, so we have a doctor now all of a sudden who's gotten on board. Yep, yeah, let's see what this looks like. Is it satisfying enough? Oh my gosh, it's a child. He's like a parasite, literally attached. How can you live with this body? Shame on you. Agreed. Look at you, you fetus. I mean, it's definitely weird. This is some, I'm guessing, Japanese. Maybe I'm racist. Uh, just weird little snuff film they created. All right, so now this is Chowder Boom Chaka Chaka Boom. Is this actually from the show on Cartoon Network, or is this like something somebody created? 
The internet is so weird. All right, guys, I need to take a bath. I feel like I need to cleanse my soul. But thank you so much for watching. If you want to see more content, make sure to click here or click here. Otherwise, subscribe on your way out, and I will see you next time. Peace.